today we're heading up to mom's to do bacon with mom. Don't cry, grandma. We're coming. What would you want to do? You want to do bread or cakes or what would you want to do first? I don't care. Because the difference between bread and cake mm -hmm. is the difference between adding the fake sugar and not. That's it. And all we have is the coconut flour. This is uh, erythritol. Uh, we have baking powder. Um, and that is, that's just the very basic of making cake or bread. And the cool thing is, is I got Lily's chocolate chips, which are sugar-free, sugar-free honey, sugar-free fudge, and you just got another thing of sugar-free uh, honey, which is really awesome. At nighttime, mm -hmm. I can eat anything sweet in the house. Candy, cookies, you name it, I eat it. We're make bread, and we're gonna make cake, and we're and the really cool thing is we're gonna make, be making some molten cake, which is really easy. This entire process only takes 90 seconds in the microwave. Pretty much guilt-free because when you are done eating this, you're done. Your sweet tooth is done completely. And that's what I need. Right. First things first, mug. It's a mug cake, right? So I got two mugs here. Yeah. We're not ever gonna make this difficult. This is gonna be so easy, it's gonna be ridiculous. How about a regular spoon and a regular fork? That's all we're gonna use. Regular fork, regular spoon, and a mug. Some coconut flour, some erythritol, and baking powder. Or butter, duh. Yeah, and eggs. This is how we're gonna do it. And we're, it doesn't have to be measured, so don't even worry about it. Just about a pat of a butter. Now we're going to melt this for 30 seconds or less. So now we have some melted butter. Check this out, Mom. It's just, this is how easy it is. Just get yourself a heaping spoonful of the coconut flour and put it in on top of your melted butter. Get your erythritol, another heaping teaspoon, and just put that on top of um, that. We have the baking powder, and you're just gonna put a tip, just the tip of your spoon. See that, Mom? That's just a tip, yeah. And put that in there. Now we're gonna take that fork we're gonna mix it up. Add the egg. Now you can see that it's all mixed up. Your basic mm -hmm. cake. You're gonna put it in the microwave. Yeah, the three. There we go. From the the sides, sides, that's yeah. perfect. Then we're just gonna tip it upside down and it pops up. You have your cake and eat it too. Yeah. It's hot. Well, that's, and it's nice that's and, firm. Nice and spongy. Yeah. Now there's also that sugar-free ma maple syrup. You got the sugar-free. Oh, yeah. Let's check out this because there's a lot more options here. We got the sugar-free uh, maple syrup. Mm -hmm. You can try that. And also sugar-free Hershey syrup. Mm -hmm. We can try that. With that maple syrup, it's almost like you're eating a pancake. Mm. That's really good. <laughs> so there's many... That would take away my sweet tooth. That would, yes. You want to try some with the uh, with the Hershey syrup? See how sure. you like. That's what I like at night. Oh, you, oh yeah, that's right. You I'm are, a night person eater. You are a chocolatey night person eater. Oh, I can eat anything chocolate. Delicious and nutritious. Mmm, chocolate's good too. Oh, sure, that's good. Good. Don't eat it all because now we're going to be doing a molten oh, chocolate. I'm getting this cake. out of the way. <laughs> You're getting out of the way. Wait until you try this one. We're gonna add a glop, a gallop, a glap, a gloop, a big. We're gonna add a big glop of hot fudge before we cook it. Okay. Or what was your favorite? The chocolate. They're all good. It just depends on what. You... What you're hungry for, right? Exactly. So we're gonna make another one. This is gonna be really quick. We got the butter. And like I said, very, very easy recipe. All we're going to do is a big spoonful like that. We're going to be doing a big spoonful like that. And then a tip like that. We are going to add the egg so we can put it all in at the same time. You don't need to do it separate. Bloop. And then mix it all up. We're going to take this sugar-free fudge and we're just going to just let it sit there on top because what's going to happen, it's going to fall down to the bottom as it's cooking. And then as we flip it upside down, we're going to have molten cake. Mm. 
right, now watch this. As you can see, it's pulled away from the sides. And as we flip it upside down, look at that. And see how there's a little hole there. So what we're going to do is we're going to just put another dollop right there. And there is your molten fudge cake that you made in 90 seconds guilt-free. All right, Mom, you got to try some of this and tell me what you think. Like that. There you go. Make a big wedge. Whoa. Look at that. Doesn't that look delicious? Mm. Chocolate person's delight. That would take care of it. <laughs> take care of your sweet tooth? By about three days worth. <laughs> <laughs> that is rich. It is rich. And it's completely guilt free. Death by chocolate? Absolutely. That's me. <laughs> Death by chocolate. <laughs> I love it. All right. Now we're going to be making bread. Same mug what we're going to do is fresh fork and spoon now the only thing different is we're not going to put the fake sugar the erythritol in there he did this because this is where we're going to toast it all right so the butter is melted now so plop that out there's our bread that easy and what we'll do is we'll tip it over and we will slice the bread then we're going to Put that in the pan to toast it. I like using the butter in there too because, you know, now you have buttery toast. So, how easy that is. You, you know, you can put jam on this. You can just eat it with butter. What's this over here, Mom? Uh, I see one over here. Is this the, open, the box? Mm -hmm. Merry mm -hmm. Christmas? Is that for me? Yes. No way. I got my own. Sweet. I love you, Mama. <laughs> My mama's the best. Okay, so there's our three little pieces of bread. Okay. See if it's see if it's the bread that you like. It has butter and mm, very sweet. Sweet? Mm -hmm. There's no sugar in it. Maybe it's the butter. I bet you anything. This uh, fake honey on it mm -hmm. would taste like cornbread with honey, and that's one of my most favorite things. This is really good. My favorite things is cornbread and honey. Mm -hmm. Wow. You want some too? <laughs> you want some too? Oh, I know you do. It must be that little bit of butter on there that makes that nice and sweet that you wouldn't even need anything on it. No, it's... Mom. <laughs> I knew you were going to say that. <laughs> if this is just the bread, mm -hmm. it's almost sweet enough that you don't need to add anything to it. Unless you have a really, really sweet tooth. Mm -hmm. Like you say, you can use maple syrup. You maple can put syrup. Oh, yeah, you want to try the maple syrup on it? That's the bread with the maple syrup. Does it taste like a pancake? It tastes just exactly like a pancake. No way. All okay, right, I'll try some. That's a pancake. Mm -hmm. That's a pancake. Okay, so we have a mug cake. We got the molten cake. We got bread or cornbread and honey and put some of that uh, maple flavor on, and then you have a pancake. Mm -hmm. All in 90 seconds. So what do you think, Mom? Is this... Is this so simple. Incredibly simple. And the first... <clears throat> it might take you one or two times to make it just so you get it right, right. for yourself. Because the way you made it, everything was perfect. So there we go, guys. We've done something amazing. And uh, that's our... Our day for Bacon with Mom. Uh, subscribe if you haven't. Um, thank you for watching. And I love my mama. <laughs> so what do you think? I lost a lot of weight? Yes. I'm down to, lost a these of 34s weight. are now loose. I'm telling you, uh, by the, in two more weeks, I'll be in 32s. Now you were fat. And I love my mom.